The clove hitch is a simple but practical knot. There are several ways to tie the clove hitch. We start with the standard method, but in the second part of the video we will show you also a very simple and fast method to tie the clove hitch. Take the end of the rope and bring it around the object. In the next step of tying the clove hitch, we are going to make another wrap around the object. Make sure to cross over the standing part of the rope. The standing part is the untouched part that disappears on the bottom of the screen. The part that I'm holding in my left hand is called the working end. A clove hitch is a simple hitch knot. It can be used to attach objects to a rope, for example a hammer or an axe. To finalize the clove hitch we take the working end, then we pass it under the second loop that we have created. All we need to do now is dress the knot and then set it. The next method is called the midline clove hitch. It's a very fast and simple method of tying the clove hitch. To tie the midline clove hitch, we simply form two loops that lay on top of each other. When that is done, you slide the object through the loops and then tighten the knot. You can do this both on the end of a rope, but also halfway. Therefore, this hitch is often referred to as the midline clove hitch.